have impacted your life in a way that um, for the rest of your lives you would always look back and appreciate what you were to me in the past. When I was your age, a very long time ago, I had friends who took part in pageants. And one, I actually encouraged them to do that because I didn't have the courage. But I was, some, some of us were behind the scenes. Some, some of us didn't have the courage to be in front of the scenes. So those were my friends who were very you know, courageous enough to step forward. And they said, okay, we will support you to go and win. And all my two friends that we supported actually won the Miss Ghana. So the Miss Ghana 86. <laughs> you hadn't even thought of it. Don't worry. I'm ancient. Miss Ghana 86 won. My friend, I suppose this is my mind, can be comfortable. And it means you are, you are rubbing shoulders with men. And if a woman is assertive uh, in our country, there is nothing in our local finances that explains what being assertive is. They will say that you are arrogant. That's the word. That's the only word they will find. If a woman is assertive, if a man is equally assertive, he's being a man. He's doing very well. He has control. He's a leader. But when a woman is assertive, she's arrogant, she's disrespectful, you know, all kinds of negative accolades will be thrown at you. But you are just doing what you have to do in the position that you've been entrusted with. And you just have to work as hard or even harder than the men who are in that same position to be seen, to be heard. You have to work 10 times harder. So unless you want to be a housewife and sit at home and what marry a rich man who will, you know, dribble honey on your tub.